guys, and here we go. Here is the magic trackpad unboxing. So, why would I get a magic track bag? Well, it's because line is out and I want to use the gestures on my Mac Pro. So, let's have a look. This is it here. Nice. Wham. And you get some instructions and shit. And no Apple stickers, boo. <laughs> so that's basically what you get. Um, here we go. So the batteries are already in it. Take it. So, yeah. It's clickable. That's the unboxing. Yeehaw. Hello. So the Magic Trackpad in all its glory, as you can see right here, set up in Lion. Mac OS 10.0. So here we go, so the main reason why you would get this for a desktop now is for Lion and to benefit from its basic uh, functionality now. So you got all your, all the main things you could do on a MacBook Pro or a MacBook Air at the moment, so this is what you can do now. So if I go three fingers and swipe, I can now go to dashboard on my left. If I swipe to the right, I can get to back to my main window or I can get to other spaces or applications in full screen mode as you can see there. Right. The other things now is that you can now take three fingers and swipe up which now gives you expose or mission control as it's called now. And this allows you to access all your applications as you can see right there if you need to see them. You go straight into them by just clicking on them and of course. And plus you've got all the other benefits obviously, you know, two finger right click. You also got the benefits of Safari. So if I go into full screen mode of Safari, we can now go up and down with two fingers scrolling. As you can see, I can now zoom in with two fingers, like so. I can also go back and forth between windows by taking one finger and pretty much swiping. So if I take, if I go into here, alright, now I want to go back and do that by two fingers, sorry, not one, two. Uh, so that is back and forth, as you can see. So I can go back and forth, no worries. So to take this out of full screen mode, I can now do other things in it, uh, that I wasn't able to do, like if I want to now go into Launchpad, I can now go into Launchpad with four fingers and pinch. There we go, there's Launchpad. Uh, to go through Launchpad, I'll just two fingers and just go back and forth like so. And go to any application as you can see right there on the screen. So if I go to clean my Mac, there we go, it brings it up straight away. Right, so other things we can also do also if you want to pinch out, this also gives you the desktop straight away like that. So there we go, it comes back if you pinch back in. So they're all the gestures basically that you can do now with Lion and it does make things a hell of a lot easier in terms of navigation around Lion. I found this incredibly useful. Obviously I still need uh, my mouse because I do need the mouse for certain things that the trackpad can't do. But for general navigation around the desktop this is actually perfect for Lion application driven. Uh, activity. But for things like, say, uh, video editing, you need the mouse to do this because you can't do it with a trackpad. It's actually quite difficult to, you know, measure up your timeline and so forth. So other than that, this is the Magic Trackpad. I do recommend it if you are going up into Lion and you do have 
say, I don't know, a Mac Pro or even possibly an iMac, but then again, you, you do have the Magic Mouse and you don't really need it if you have the Magic Mouse but in this case I did need it because I don't have a Magic Mouse for my uh, Mac Pro I have a Razer Def as a laser mouse and I don't intend to trade it for anything on my Mac Pro so I figured if I want to use the gestures then obviously I go have to get a trackpad for it because I'm not going to stand here with I'm going to have I'm not going to have two mouse uh, one Magic and one normal mouse so yeah so that's my take on the magic mouse and I do rec uh, sorry not the magic mouse the magic trackpad and I do recommend getting it if you're on a Mac Pro with a wired mouse cheers